guys i wanted to talk to you guys today about birth control uh, contraceptive rings there are two rings on the market one is called nova ring and this is the packaging of the nova ring and it's a disposable ring uh, for a monthly use the newer one which is which just came on the market is called anovera and it's one ring you can use it for the entire year. Now the way these rings are used um, is um, is you you uh, let me take this nova ring out of the package and show it to you. So look at it. It's a very small, soft, flexible ring, and the ring has got hormones in it. So what you do is that. Um, at the beginning of your menstrual cycle which will be day two to five uh, wash your hands and you're gonna take the ring out of this packaging squeeze it now you have to squeeze it and I'm gonna show you on this model squeeze it and put it in the vagina just like you put a tampon in right so put it in the vagina once you put it in it opens up and you just push it with your finger and it will go and sit there so once it's inserted nova ring stays there for three weeks and then at the end of the third week put your finger in the vagina and you just pull it out it's as simple as that now you if you're using it for the first time you're gonna be scared and a little anxious about using the ring couple of things you can do. You can um, wash your hands, try and relax. You can put it in the shower. While you are in the shower, you are relaxed. The warmth of the warm water has relaxed your muscles and it might be easy to just slip this ring into the vagina. You can do it in other positions too. You can lay down on the couch or on a bed with your legs spread. You can just squeeze this and put it in. If you think squeezing it with one hand is hard, you can use both your ha hands. Like squeeze it this way and this way, and then just put it in the vagina. So you can do it laying down, you can do it squatting like a, like a sumo wrestler, you know, squat down on the, um, on the ground and just put the ring in the vagina and then just uh, push it back. And the third position will be in the bathroom. Um, on put your one leg up on a toilet and squeeze the ring with one hand, open the vagina with the other hand and just push it in. Now once it goes in, it's a very flexible ring, so it adjusts to your body. It adjusts it inside. So no matter what you are doing, it's not gonna come out. I promise you that it does not come out. It, if it needs to be adjusted, just push it with your finger and, and, and it will, you will. But a lot of people ask me, oh, I'm a runner, um, I work out, I exercise hard, do you think it's just gonna come out? No, vagina stays closed, it is gonna stay in there. Um, so don't worry about it. Even during sex, you do not need to take this ring out. As I show you, did you see that it goes up and it stays there? It's not going to bother you. It's not going to bother him. I have done pap smears with the ring in there as well. You don't need to take it out for pap smear. There's absolutely no reason for you to take this ring out. But for whatever reason, if you do, then you have to make sure the ring is back inside um, within two hours. Just rinse it with some warm water. Don't use hot water. Hot water will release the hormone. Remember, it has hormones in it. So the hot water will release the hormones. Don't do that. Just wash it with the warm water. Put it in. If you're having difficulty putting the ring in, you can use a little bit of a coconut oil and put it in, or just like a water-soluble, you know, lubricant of any kind, like a KY or something, and, and, and just push it in. You can put a dry one in too, but it really depends upon how you want to do it. So once the ring is in, it starts um, releasing the hormones in the vagina. So once you put the ring in, it has to be there for seven days before it is effective. So for the first seven days, use some alternative birth control along with the ring.
okay um, you should be using condoms anyways for prevention of sexually transmitted diseases for, for prevention of the pregnancy is really important to remember that um, the, uh, the ring is very effective um, the failure rate of the ring is very low less than one percent the reason is it's in the vagina and it's releasing the hormone continuously now the side effects of the ring are just like uh, side effects of any other hormone containing birth control less than that but you can experience uh, nausea uh, breast tenderness headaches some women complain of a little excessive vaginal discharge because the ring has estrogen in it and it keeps releasing it but the discharge is a very clear discharge without any odor or irritation if that something bothers you then obviously we're gonna we have to talk about some different birth control option now the second ring which is out on the market anovera Anovera is a little, I don't have an example of it, but it's a little thicker ring than, uh, than the, the Nuva ring is, but it's as effective. What you do basically is that when you take the Nuva ring out, you toss it in a garbage, right? Because this is a disposable one. The Anovera ring, because it's good for a year, once you take it out, just rinse it with a um, soap and water, just a warm water, and put it in the container they give you. So it's the same way, it's three weeks in and one week out. So at the end of that one week when it's out, when your menstrual cycle is starting, put the ring back in. Failure rate of Anovera is the same as the Nova ring, very low. It's very well tolerable. I know whenever I talk to my patients about a vaginal ring as an option for birth control, the, uh, a lot of them, they freak out thinking, oh my God, I don't want anything in the vagina. Oh my God, is, am I going to feel it? Is it going to fall out? What if I'm wearing a thong? Is it going to uh, come out of it? It does not. So I, I assure them most of the time, I say, okay, use it one time and you will know. And I think once you use it for one or two months, you get comfortable, you literally feel forget it that it's there once it's inserted you might feel a little you know pressure like just like when you start using tampons for the first time how it feels it feels like a little uncomfortable but as the time goes by um, you, you you forget it's there so same with the ring so if that's something interests you try it if you have any questions regarding the the Nova ring call your gynecologist or, or, or call me uh, contact me my number is 810-720-1790 or uh, my website is uh, hardestobgyn.com or my uh, Instagram account is um, Glam Guy now. I will uh, try and answer all your questions talk to you guys soon bye